Is my room crooked? Why is my room crooked? What the fuck? What happened? I fucking love knobs. Did something move? Did we break something? Fine. Love the Elsa shirt. You broke your PP. That's true. Ah, uh, Rare Noise, thank you for the 21 months. Omar, thank you for the 29 months. Where is my I Survive No Not November t shirt? I love Nobs. One Drunk Man, thank you for the 29 months. All right, I need to fix the room being crooked because it's gonna drive me like absolutely insane. It's not helping. Santa this Christmas? Nope. But I am going to be a captain of sorts. Can we just watch Garp VOD? That was so wholesome. I mean, you can watch it. It's fine. It's fine. I fucking love Medieval. Nog. Oh shit, we, we gotta update the profit sheet. All right, let's do that now. Medieval, thank you for reminding me. Let's uh, let's update the profit sheet. Profit. All right, uh, so your mic is quiet. Yeah, why is it so quiet? What the fuck? Hello? Hello? I, I don't know what happened. It just got, oh, okay. Hello, 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 hello. Okay, that's better. Okay. I fucking love knobs. Marcel, thank you for the nine months. All right, stream profit, let's go. We're down $2,886. Awesome. Uh, all right, Patreon, uh, Patreon, I'll check my bank. I just checked Patreon. No, check the bank. Uh, Patreon, $270.99. Fucking huge. Uh, while we're here, my Amazon was... Oh, Elsa, shut the fuck up. Why are you meowing? It was $38. 55 cents. All right, we're good. All right, so uh, Twitch, let's check Twitch. November 1st, November 30th. Uh, okay, where's the part where you tell me how much money? Earnings. Thank you. But why did you move it? It was there. 
You, you're literally fucking pulling an apple and just making things take more clicks. There you go. Nope, nope, nope. That's for donos. Okay, donos we check. Stream elements. I fucking love knobs. Yeah, it was there, but it wasn't like, it's really hard to click on it and like copy it. We got zero dollars. Fuck yeah. Wait, did we actually get zero dollars? For like all of November? Wow, okay, well, feels fucking bad, man. All right, and YouTube, uh, I'm just gonna check it on my phone. It's not gonna be a huge amount. It's gonna be like $15 or something. Uh, analytics. Uh, revenue, estimated revenue, November, uh, $17.85. Okay. We're good. Uh, this has yet to even be put in here. But yeah, I did pick up, I did pick up a new stream PC, which is why we're down $2,200. And also like October was, was a no profit month. So nice. Benel, thank you for the 18 months. You put Twitch earning in March tab. There was zero March. I know for a fact. Like we did technically sell some shirts, but it wasn't selling some shirts. It was me buying March for patron debt. So there was no profit on it. Okay, also just play very loudly with your mousey. Okay, we're good. I mean, we're still down $2,202.74. Beautiful. It's beautiful. What a year. What a year. Wait, how fucked is this year? It's pretty fucked. It's pretty fucked. When did the yelling begin? Uh, right now, let's go. I fucking love knobs. I fucking love knobs. I fucking Any autofocus love about? knobs. Oh, probably. There we go. All right, uh, let's reset our scores. Check out the links. Okay, there's like nothing this week. Cool. That's actually really cool. That's just so good. Ah, oh. I love how the camera doesn't even fit in there. Oh, you can see my table. There's like my table. Check out that table. That my camera is very, very focused on for some reason. That's a, that's a nice table. Look at it. Look at it. Oh, now it's focusing on me. Thanks, camera. Ah, all right. <clears throat> Shall we? Shall we? Let's go. A6.5. Updated. Okay, wait, no, we're not ready. I'm not ready. Simon, you seemed more emotional giving away the Jane than hearing the Th October song. No. Also ready? Yeah, she's she's ready. She's fucking she's going wild. She can sit there when she feels like it. Ah can I do this? I can but I, I don't fit in frame. All right, a little bit more wine. Mm. 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 All right, let's go. Ace 6.5 updated, okay. Hello everyone, this is Create Keeps, glad to see you again. Okay, first of all, recap sheet. 
let's let's try and remember what I said about this the first time. Okay. It got a newspaper because board is too generic, not much to say. Maybe needed some more pre-IC development. Okay. I fucking love knobs. Hi, Simon. Please remember, I am still not a gamer, despite what my name might suggest. 33X is not available. All right, buddy. All right, buddy. Nice try. Hello everyone, this is Create Keeps. Glad to see you again. A space here would have been nice. The A6.5 is based on playing cards and magic tricks. Designer Dufin had a love for magic and cards since he was young. He wants to share that love with the keyboard community and maybe teach some tricks along the way. Are you is is are you telling us this is a scam? Okay. Create Keeps update the Proto A6.5 and presents a new look to you. Now let's start the magic of the A6.5. Okay, so it's a 65% with a explodey nav cluster and a top right blocker. Cool. Let's see if it has a usable bottom row. Okay, it comes in colors, just like every other keyboard. Okay, so it has eight screw holes, but apparently only four of them are full. So you don't actually put any screws up here. Okay. It's, it's, it's this whole new, like amazing idea where you only screw the bottom, but you don't screw the top. It's for feel. It's for feel. Okay. That way your top row will feel very thocky. Okay. Nice. General keyboard information, 6063, comes in a bunch of colors, mostly e-code because eh. it's seven degree grade, nice. The weight is stainless steel chroma mirror PVD slash brass matte weight. Okay, so either PVD steel or just matte brass, got it. This does not look matte for the record. This does not look matte, that looks glossy as fuck. So your renders are not only missing screws, but they're inaccurate. Uh, mounting, full plate gasket mount, half plate gasket mount, 1.6 millimeter PCB. You can either get a alu palm or a carbon fiber half plate, okay. It has one foam, two foam, three foam, four foam, four foam. Cool, that's what I love. A whole bunch of fucking foam. All right, uh, non-adjusted front height of 20.62. PCB looks like memes. It literally just made it a standard layout and it would have used a standard PCB instead of needing to fucking do this fucking nonsense up here. Mm -hmm. Cool. And you can have all the suits of the cards. Mm -hmm. All right. You had do you have a target price for this? All right, is it in the IC form? No, so there's, there's, there's no target price for this. You already know you're including playing cards and you're not giving me a fucking target price. I mean, okay, listen, like they're doing some cool shit on the PCB with, you know, with the copper mask and, and whatnot, fine, okay. That, this is the one cool thing, okay? That's cool. That's pretty cool. The rest is uninspired, boring, and just objectively bad. Because not only are you rendering the wrong things, you're not rendering screws. You, your attention to detail is so poor in this IC that it's a reflection of the product you're gonna deliver. If you, if you can't be asked to make a good IC, you're not gonna be asked to make a, a good keyboard group buy. You've heard of No Nut November, get ready for End My Life December. No, no, the, the follow-up to No Nut November is Decimate These Nuts December, DDND. All right, so this had a newspaper before and they updated it. So I'm not 
I'm gonna update my score, okay, from a newspaper to two newspapers for a total of three newspapers. Why? You know why. I Do I have to explain myself to you guys? Just like show of hands. Like this is something, this is a pandemic special. This is like, you know, designer sitting at home with fuck all to do. Let me design a keyboard so I can make money. Bro, you're not going to sell a single fucking unit of this. I thought it was destroyed dick December. <gasps> I'll take it. Destroyed dick December. Uh, for the record, they didn't show us layout support at any point. Literally the keyboard. Literally the keyboard. The thing that matters the most on a keyboard is where do the switches go? Okay. You haven't shown me any fucking layout support besides like the cursed fucking stock layout. Is there any other layout? Apparently fucking not. So like the only fucking thing that matters about the keyboard is something just not in the IC. That's fucking great. You know what? Spoon. I'm taking back my two newspapers. I'm giving it two spoons. Okay. Yeah. I just realized. Like zero layout information, a board that looks like it was designed ages ago, sloppily put together IC. Where the fuck is the target price? What is this uninspired fucking work? Do you see how this text is not actually aligned in the center? Do you see that? Do you see that? That the text is not where it should be? And you're actually gonna print this on playing cards. Again, you, it's such an indication of how little you fucking care. You know what, here's another spoon. Do I gamble? I never gamble. I'm not a gambler. All right. Next, we've got the Orbit 65%. I hope this is an AI03 Orbit, please, please. It is not. All right, Orbit 65%, curved silicone pin top mount, 17 millimeter front height. Designed by Machina. Hmm. Okay, so it's like, okay, 65. Slash key cult, okay. Okay, so either you go full brass bottom or you get four internal bottom inserts, which, okay. Okay. That's kind of cute, but if you're gonna do this, you may as well go full out and just extend this a little bit, okay. Hmm. All right. Hello, I am Rabbit from Australia, introducing my first keyboard project, Orbit by Malkina 65% silicon pin mounting style keyboard. I've been wanting a 65% keyboard ever since I tried the tadpole mounting on a frog TKL. You should have waited for Gion to make a 65%. Started last year as a personal project. I received my first prototype this October. Okay. The main idea of the design is to keep the keyboard as slim as possible. Internally, trying to make a clean sounding keyboard with the least amount of foam. So that means zero foam. The external curves and an internal weight pattern give me an astronomy vibe. Okay. Kind of looks like sound waves or any other wave. I hope this keyboard is also in your orbit. You son of a bitch, I'm in. All right. The look of this keyboard is influenced by the HHKB, HG, and non-HG, got it. Seven degree angle, 17 mil front height, it isn't. Uh, silicone pin tadpole, three hardness options, just like me. Screwless exterior design, fuck you. Uh, In-house design with USB-C daughter board, why? Literally PCBs exist. Uh, will come with a matching carry case, that's good. Materials, alu top, two bottom, full PVD aluminum bottom with four internal brass weights, or a full brass bottom with a clear coat finish. 
Okay. Actual layout support. Good job. Prototype photos. Yep, that looks like a K. That looks like a better K. Okay, yeah. Yeah. It's cruise under the feet. You son of a bitch. You're right. It does. Okay, I respect it. I respect it. All right, yeah. All right, I came into this angry. I'm slightly less angry. All right, so originally it was a 1.2 mil PCB with flex cuts, four screws between the top and the bottom, and four separate rubber feet. The new one has a better PCB, thank you. Eight screws between the top and bottom are changed to two long rubber feet instead of eight. Okay, I, I get you. So there's like, oh, you're literally using frog feet. Okay, cool. Uh, testing brass patina, quality of life changes, silicon pan position. Okay, okay. So you've made revisions to your prototype. Uh, there's one problem there. It's foam. Why is there foam? Why? Okay, the minimum amount of foam is zero foam. Okay. Actually, the minimum amount of foam is negative foam, where when I sell a keyboard and it arrives to your house, I'm secretly in the box and I jump out and I take all the foam in your house and I fucking steal it and then go light it on fire. That's the minimum amount of foam. <laughs> I'm sorry, this fucking got me. Uh, all right, so you've made changes. It's good. I like it. I will have estimate pricing after gathering enough feedback. Okay, so you, you still don't know your MOQ. I mean, you can just YOLO an MOQ and just say, hey, price point is approximately this many dollars at this many units, like plus or minus, you know? That's okay. You can do that. Uh, Australian man doing Australian stuff. Okay. Okay, who is Naha Keys? I don't know who you are. You, you have JWK on your front page. That's, that's minus three Simon points right there. You do have lubricant though. All right, let, let me see what kind of lubricant you have. All right, you've got 205 and you've got 105. You know, that's fine. I know about the AI-03 orbit. I just thought that he like figured out a way to do like a split ergo 65%. I know there's already an orbit. I was part, I was supposed to be part of the initial private buy of the original orbit, but it was too expensive for me. Okay, you know what? You know what? You, you, you did good. You did good. All right, you did good. You've got prototypes, you're making revisions. You, you did screwless in the non-shitty way. You, you're doing good. Good job, Rabbit. I'm gonna give you an okay hand, okay? If you had a target price and like, I don't know, like huge hairy balls, I'd give you an eggplant. Just a target price, I'll give you an eggplant. Give you two eggplants for the balls. All right, next we have the Frog Board 60. Hi, it's fish. Kinda sus. I know it's been a while and a lot of stuff happened in my personal life, that's why it took so long. But the Frog Board is back. With the finale finished design, you're missing an L, buddy. And a lot of prototypes, the board will soon be able to be held in your hands. Why did you line break? For those that, is this tree leaf? For those who are new or forgot about the project, period. It is a 60%. Okay. Please tell me you're in like some other country. So like, like, wh where are you? Like, please tell me like English is not your first language. Cause then like, it's fine. I, I won't judge. All 
All right, we're gonna have to fucking detect this shit. All right, he's using German layout. All right. But here is US ANSI. Okay, could go either way. Could go either way. Hmm. All right, it's fine. It's a 60% case made out of ABS plastic. It is the standard bo uh, poker. <laughs> Poker standoff, so all normal 60% PCBs and... Okay, so it's straight on. Also, it looks like a frog, that's the whole point. Also, the corners got rounder, lol, shout out, G-Bins, okay. Yep, that's a, that's, that, that's a frog keyboard, if I've ever seen one. I never realized I took a lot of pictures of prototypes, but never really shared them anywhere. I don't know how that happened, you forgot. I am very rarely on Geek Hack and never saw the late replies to my post, but they really cheered me up and I hope they're still interested. Okay, this guy has to be like 14 or 13 or some shit. Thank you, here are some ways you can keep up with the project. Sound test. Okay, let's try to figure it out from his fingers. Oh my God, oh my God. That's a CRT. Part one. Part two is like, He's using like the worst camera on the planet. Okay, the hands look somewhat young. All right, maximum 18 years old. Harry, but 18. But like judging by the CRT and your, your terrible video quality, either you're not smart enough to record it with your phone, which means you're young, or your phone is dog shit, which means you're young because you can't afford to like get a better phone. So, okay. There's no real information. There's no like angle, there's no weight, there's like no info. All right, wait, let's find out more. That is a disassembled fan. That is missing the front grill. So you are most definitely a child because it's spinning in the picture. And that looks like a porcelain puppy of sorts that belonged to your grandmother. Okay, wh wh what else can we identify? All right, very dusty, very dusty. And I assume that's the terrible webcam you used? Is that an Alienware monitor? Yeah, he's definitely like fucking 14 years old. No, nobody, no adult I buys a fucking Alienware nuts. monitor. That's like buying fucking Louis Vuitton earbuds. Petrov, thank you for the 31 months. Oh my God, didn't the cancellation go through? All right, so listen, there's nothing wrong with this project. I'm gonna give it an okay hand, it's cute, okay? I'm gonna newspaper you because you gotta put some info in here, dude. Like, how much does it weigh? Uh, approximately how much money will it be? Uh, what is the angle? You know, basic stuff like that. You're saying ABS, is it gonna be molded ABS? Is it going to be machined ABS? Is it going to be 3D printed ABS? Alienware unironically making some banger QD OLED monitors. Yes, 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 they are now. Okay, this is an old Alienware monitor, okay? This kid can't afford a fucking, you know, baffle on the front of his, you know, $15 fan. So, he's not getting one of those QD OLEDs, all right? I'll give this an okay hand, just to be nice, because I'm not gonna bully children on the internet, because I'm pretty sure that's illegal in the country that he's currently in. Which, like, judging by the sunlight, judging by the fact that there's a fan, Judging by German layout and judging by the shape of his hands, he's German. It has been quite a warm summer in Germany. Okay, alas, 60%. How about the CRT bottle? I, I can't tell over his 240p video quality. All right, alas, gummy O-ring friction fit mounting style. How is this German? I just, I know, I know. 
Hi, this is an interest check for my new project. Alas, it's a 60% keyboard with a gummy O-ring friction fit mount. I design the board to look simple, but I add some subtle curve in the bottom to help user pick up and move the board easily. Okay, see, this is China. It's very easy to figure out like who is China and who's not. Uh, the top side bezel of the keyboard, both left and right, will have a curve as well to make the side profile looks simple but sleek. See, that, that happens when you're Google translating. Uh, this board will have internal and external weight made of brass to give heft to it. The weight will sandwich, to be fair, it could be another Asian country. Uh, the weight will sandwich the thin layer of aluminum in the middle to absorb the vibration and reverberation and eliminate unwanted hollowness. Since we make the tolerance tighter than normal friction fit board, we designed the plate with cutout on the top and bottom to make the typing feel still bouncy and soft without any compromise from tighter tolerance. Okay, so it basically tell me it's a unicorn without telling me it's a unicorn. Aluminum 6063 for main bottom, main body, sandblasted brass for internal and external weight, seven degree typing angle, friction fit, 20 mil front height, non-adjusted, 3.2 kilos fully built, PCB by Yankar. Okay, you're probably in Korea, 50 units. Yep, that's a very helpful photo. Layout support, good. You've got Christian bottom row and Normie bottom row. Split BS, R shift, and no ISO support because fuck you. This is the plate. Here's a prototype. Yep. Pricing TBD. Okay. RME Studio. Didn't realize that RME was getting into making keyboards. Thought they just made, you know, sound equipment. Ah. All right. There's nothing that's like jumping out at me and also my room is too hot. Give me a second. I had, I had the thermometer at my gaming temperature. I was playing, I was doing some gaming earlier with a friend, but for group by reviews, I needed two degrees lower because I get sweaty. Just seeing, seeing all these sexy keyboards gets me all hot. All right, he, here's the thing. Like this is going to be expensive, like for sure. At 50 units and three kilos, it's going to be expensive from like a design perspective, this is all you're giving me, bro. Like, what does it look like? What does it look like? Like, I can see half of a keyboard here and like a poorly aligned escape. And here I can see, again, half of a keyboard. I see this, okay, what does it look like from the side? Does it look like anything from the side? I wish I could fucking know. No, it doesn't, it looks like a wedge. Like, I have to sit here and fucking detective this shit to try and figure out what the product is and what it fucking looks like. All right, listen, this is going to be pricey if it's going to be three kilos. But like design wise, like what, like, what are you actually doing? Like, it's, does this do anything for you guys? Cause like, this doesn't do anything for me. It looks like a, like a super basic bitch 60. And also there's like no cutouts for like where the bump ons go. Do you just YOLO those into fucking place? I think the answer is yes. Is this tie? It could be. Could be. The engravings look like tie. Could be. Reinventing tofu. Yep. The hero we didn't ask for and absolutely fucking deserve. All right. Did I just see a cat? No, I saw my own shadow. You know what? Let the people, let the people speak. What do you guys say? 
Like, like, how do you feel about this? I say we give him a pee pee hand. We're not ready for it yet. What am I typing on? Something forbidden. I'm typing on Garf's favorite keyboard. This is Garf's favorite keyboard. I like 60s, but I don't like that one. Yeah, like, listen, I'm, I'm not a 60 hater. Okay, I'm not a 60 enjoyer, but like if I see a good 60, I'm like, okay, this is doing some good shit. This is not, this is not doing some good shit. I wanna know who the person who pressed eggplant is, and I will find out. I'll come to your house and steal all your phone. Ah. Cursed S-A-D-W keys, you mean W-A-S-D? They're not cursed, they're PPS which is an amazing plastic material for gaming. What keycaps are on the Ebola pulled? Uh, uh, heavily modified GMK P number and some PPS caps. All right, the majority of people say newspaper, so this is gonna get a newspaper. Let, let the record show that the viewers gave this the newspaper and not me. But if it was up to me, I'd probably give it a newspaper. And more people voted for newspaper than I am a weeb. What the fuck is going on? Are you guys okay? I'm actually really fucking concerned. Okay, no, no, no. Are you a weeb? I am a weeb. I am not. Okay, one minute pull. Really, Twitch? Really? 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 Content does not meet guide. Okay, let's go. Let, let's check out what, what Twitch considers like content. Channels you think you like. Okay. Japan, Japanese, anime, English. Yeah, yeah, this is fine. This is fine. Yeah, this is, this is fucking totally fine. Okay. Yeah, that, that's bad. We can't fucking have that. I didn't even review the fucking art for this week. We're gonna do it last. This looks like a stream Paul would watch. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. All right, S65 V2. I fucking love knobs. Benny, thank you. Hi everyone. Since we decided to do the S80 V2 a few months ago, many customers have asked us to prepare round two. But considering the shipping weight for the S80, we decided to do a 60% version. Now 65% V2 is coming. The first batch is only 100 units. CNC manufacturing is already underway. There's a 3.5 inch IPS screen. 320 by 480 resolution. Nice. You can modify the theme UI and background picture or make a theme to match your keycaps and desk setup. Okay. 3.5 inches massive. Yeah, the 0.5 really makes a difference. You know, I don't hate this. Th those are terrible keycaps, but like the board is actually interesting. So I wish it was touch screen though. That'd be nice. Not from Sam. Thanks Sam.
All right. So soldered only, nice. Wing keyless or wing key, NC and ISO support, split right shift, step caps, Christian bottom row, seven degree angle, non-adjusted 20 mil front height, PVD silver alloy external weight, top mount. Okay, there's a lot of good shit in here. Aluminum case, solder PCB, palm plate, nice. Built 2.5 kilos, that's not fucking bad. Under 300 bucks. I mean, I am an FRL enjoyer, okay? I am a big simp for FRL. What firmware does it run? Not via. You know? I, I don't hate this. <coughs> to be fair, in terms of like the shape of the board, it's an FRL, but in terms of like the keys that it has, it's a 65%. Because consider how many keys would a 65% have? You'd have like one, two, three. Fuck, I need to look at a 65%. Uh. All right, so you have you have four additional keys, include like plus the arrows. So you have arrows and one, two, three, four additional keys. It's exactly a 65%. So they're correct calling it a 65, even though it's an FRL. All right, eggplant. Eggplant, almost spoon worthy. Listen, listen, there are, there are two kinds of projects, okay? There are projects that are trying to do something new and there are projects that are trying to do something old. At least this is trying to do something new and it's not like $800. No background check? What do you mean? We all know not from Sam. Yeah, the QC is gonna be dog shit. It's 300 bucks for this. What do you expect? What, are, what about the projects that are trying to take my money? That's a subcategory. They can be either. It's not touch screen, it's just a normal screen. Ah. So like, you could put your favorite anime in there. My favorite anime is Naruto. How does one solder the screen? It's probably just a ribbon cable that goes into a JST. All right. Next, we've got the Zoom 75. Hi, everyone. We are excited to let you know we have worked out initial designs for Zoom 75 based on our designs and community feedback and would love to release more renders to further finalize the specifications. All right, comes in wild green, scarlet red, blush pink, navy, blue sky, lilac, white, cool gray, and uncool gray. Nice. All right, so it's gasket mounted using the, the condom technique. It's got some foam, it's got an internal weight, a back plate and an external weight. Okay. And you can have a screen apparently up here. All right, wing key, fuck you. 70 spacebar, ISOs. Okay, so like all the things I want, but it's wing key only. Okay. Modular top right to you LCD knobs badges. So you can put your favorite anime in there. Side mounting, side mounting on gasket is fine. Because with gasket, you're not aiming for flex, you're aiming for bounce. So there is like from a field perspective, it's actually better if you have side mounting on a gasket board. Uh, if you're top or bottom mounting or using other more interesting mounts, then yeah. All right. It's very cool. You can watch Pokemon on it. All right, uh, it's got knobs. Uh, there's, there's more colors. There's more colors. You've got Drac purple, plum, light brown, dark brown, orange, yellow, teal, cream. Wait, where's my nut button? And silver. All right, like Zoom 65 has both PVD mirror and anodized weights. Cool, cool, okay. And engravings, you can have cute telescope, 
shooting stars, horizontal lines, or diagonal lines. I like cute telescope. More thoughts. Uh, okay. There's no target price, but this is this is a very early IC. They're literally just trying to figure out colors, so I'm not gonna be a dick. Also, their Zoom TKL and 65s were fucking dirt cheap, so I'm kind of down. Not eggplant tier, not until I see the price. But I can watch Pokemon on my blocker. So I'm gonna give it an okay hand. It's a Zoom, it'll be like $8. I'm, all, I'm fucking down. Thank you, Seekeeb, for making really, 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 really cheap shit. I appreciate it. But it's a 75. I know it's a 75. That doesn't make it objectively bad. It makes it subjectively bad because I don't like 75, but like, Paul likes 75 because he's a huge cuck. Okay. Yay, we did it. We did it. All right. So Elsa never comes into the room when I'm doing group buy reviews. She knows. She knows when I'm doing group buy reviews. Like if I'm doing a build, she'll come hang out a little bit. Wow, today is going to be a short stream. It's okay. It's okay. It's all right. Mm. Code Pro, why is there cum stains on your shirt, Simon? Well, I'm gonna answer that while answering the uh, sellout command that was just redeemed. Uh, many of you know that this is a not-for-profit stream, so like all the money that comes in, like specifically, has to be spent on stream stuff. Not keyboards, not alcohol, not food. Uh, not t-shirts that I wear while giving hand jobs to Smurfs, just stream stuff. And uh, yeah, I mean, if 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 you like my content, you should probably go to youtube.com slash Black Simon, where you can probably learn a thing or two. And if you don't like my content, then eat my ass. You'd give hand jobs to Smurfs for free? I never said it was for money. Of course it's for free. They're Smurfs. There's only one Smurfette, dude. They need all the help they can get. <sighs> yeah. Ah. <sighs> dude, I'm so sweaty. Objective fact, Simon, best key creator. Objective fact, I'm the worst keyboard creator. Dude, I'm getting like zero views on my fucking sand glass video, by the way. Like literally zero. Wait, let, let, let me literally, like, let's, let's literally. Ranking by views, eight out of 10. Yeah, that's kind of bad. It's kind of bad. This is literally underperforming like everything. This is underperforming every one of my videos ever. Feels fucking bad. That's because you lock it, but no, no, these these metrics are uh, like after it goes properly live. How long did it take you to do the sand glass video? Like, so generally I spend four to five weeks with the board before I'll put out a review for it, if I choose to put out a review. So that means like four to five weeks of typing on it and like figuring out different builds in it and stuff like that. Then I do the review. And then like the review itself is like a couple hours of shooting an hour of B-roll, an hour of editing. So, so yeah. Any Russian hard-based streams coming up? Oh, you mean secret streams. Sure YouTube doesn't take the... Yes, I am sure. That's why I gave you the answer, because I was sure. If I wasn't sure, I would shut the fuck up. All right, Brutal V2 1800. 400 bucks for a triple weight. Okay, so here's the thing. I'm gonna say this now, okay? This is a fair price, but I preferred it when the Brutal series was cheaper, okay? I am okay with having like 
you, you've got like your Chimera tier, you've got your like original Brutal tier, and this kind of sits in between them. And if you're gonna make it sit in between them, then don't use the Brutal uh, the the Brutal branding. Like this is mid tier. You need like new nomenclature for your low tier because this again is fine, but don't call it a Brutal. No, to be fair, it's called direct, right? Like the, the cheaper one is called direct, right? 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 Brutalist series. Can somebody confirm? Brutal is their design style. No, I get that. But like nomenclature is very important, you know, like I look at this and I'm like, oh, this is a lot more expensive than the first Brutal series. Why? Okay, so the previous 1800 is the Rekt. Okay. Yeah, this looks fine. I mean, it's good shit. It's done by AI03 and Ken Keys. Upas and AI03 are both solid fucking dudes. Uh, would I personally spend $400 on this 1800? No, because if I'm going to spend 400, I may as well spend like 550 and like go up to like, you know, like a Heine BHCP or something like that. Personally, does that make it a don't buy? Absolutely not. This is absolutely a buy. Like if you want a nice 1800, fucking go for it. No LED indicators. That's true. That's true. Alternatively, you can use shine through caps for your for your caps and your num lock and your scroll lock. 390 for solder. That's nice. Is the arrow keys crooked? No more crooked than my PP. You can tell how bad the dice sub is on this. Oof. Yeah, this would be a better deal if it was priced at 300 to 350, obviously. But like, it's decently heavy, right? Any weight information? Hello? Yeah, apparently it weighs nothing. Bro, how do you not weigh your fucking keyboard? You measured it. M measure, measure the gravity. Measure gravity. For fuck's sake. Added heft. Oh, cool. If only I could fucking know how much heft it is. There's nothing wrong with cast weights, by the way. If you've got internal weights, use cast weights. Like it's a lot cheaper and it doesn't fucking matter. Gravity is a social cup. Are you in my walls? Are you literally in my walls? <clears throat> uh. He knows too much. He knows too much. I literally, I literally said that yesterday to somebody. Does dimension conversions look wrong? Close enough. Listen, I'm gonna keep this as a buy. It's fine. It's decent shit. Uh, I'll, I'll try and pick up a brutal 65 at some point to review when I can be bothered. Just to see, because like I I reviewed the original Brutal 65 and I loved it. I'd like to see what the new generation is. Comment on zinc weight. It's fine. Again, it's internal and it's a decent material for internal. It's better than steel internal. And the fact that it's cast doesn't fucking matter at all. Like zinc is relatively soft. It's kind of like brass. Do you like the sonic property of zinc? I have, like, I know that it's close to brass, but I've never used it. Is zinc cheaper than copper? That's a good question. I feel like they'd, they'd be like equally priced, wouldn't they? For like cast material. But copper is a little bit like harder than brass. I think zinc is a little bit softer than brass. Anyway. Vertex Arc 6G. 
Congratulations, I am the 2000th viewer. All right, we've seen this before. It's the Ark, it's a 6G. I'm getting one to review soon. Uh, it's cool. Uh, the only thing that matters is the price point and like how much material and weight is in it. So it starts at $275, which is fucking insane for the record. Like 269, it starts at 269. I think I'm getting this color by the way. 269 for this, kind of insane for like a two piece plus weight, internal and external. And you can pay extra for, for foam, which is amazing. It's fucking solid. That's not a weight. Well, listen, listen, buddy, listen. It replaces the space of the aluminum and weighs more. It is a weight. Oh, you have to pay for the weight, don't you? Wait, let me let me confirm. Hello? See the spec. Where spec? Under group by information. Got it. Okay. All aluminum. Okay, it's all aluminum. Still pretty good. It's still pretty good. It's 265 bucks. I'll get brass in mine. I mean, like, I, this is information I've already shared, so. Listen, I give this assignment approved by. If it's a board that I chose to actually receive and review, it's something I like, so. Like, this is on par pricing wise to like the Augur 60. And the Augur 60, sure, it had a small brass weight, but like, Vertex's shit is on point. Vertex's shit is on point. Oh, it's gold anodized aluminum weight. Interesting. That looks a lot like brass. Okay. Ah, <sighs> all right. Hey, we did it. Got that. All right. 60 without brass can sound good? Yeah, of course it can. Dub Viper sounds fucking amazing and it's all, all aluminum. Then again, it's very hefty. All right, type out a game from Novel Keys. Really? Six user reviews feels fucking bad. Okay. Uh, this isn't your typical typing test. Unlock power-ups, create a loadout, and battle your way through prompts as fast and accurately as you can to allocate power-ups and str strategically attack your opponents in an effort to slow them down. This is literally the Navy Zeal's copy pasta. It's like four dollars, okay. That's all the information. 200 megabytes of RAM? How am I supposed to run this on my fucking Raspberry Pi? Wait. Okay, I can run it. I can run it. 
Download more dedotated de 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 wham. I could use a little bit more wham. What the fuck? Why? Why? First, go to monkey type. Go to monkey type and you can write words. I'm so good at typing. Look how good I am. Oh yeah. So good. Yeah. 10. There's Battle Royale in Monkey's Height. Well, there you go. Oh shit, I closed it. All right, double shot PU keycaps long version. All right, wait, is this, is this the guy? Oh, it's Keymax, okay. Keymax is all right. God, that is epic music. All right, let's go, let's see what's going on. Oh, it's one of these videos. Oh, yes. Yes, daddy. All right. Yeah, Lego me. Ah. I do not have enough wine for this. I have like one sip left. Feels bad. Dude, this guy must be so rich if he can afford this many Legos. I wish I had that kind of Lego money. Oh yeah, pour that green slime. Oh, that's hot. Oh yeah. Richard Danish? Are they cheaper in the Denmark? Or do you mean he like broke into the Lego factory the same way I'm gonna break into your house and steal all your phone? He charges between four and $16 per keycap. Nice. You just get two big scoops on your birthday? Scoops of Lego? Kinda hot. Oh yeah. Oh, that's hard. Good. Okay. Isn't Keymax check? Oh. I don't know. Lego is cheaper from America. Everything's cheaper from America except healthcare and security and all the things that matter. Oh yeah, snippet baby. Oh yeah. Those are some good snips right there. Ooh. Yeah, it's not rusty nail clippers, but listen, it is the GIMP set. It's pretty lit. Yeah. 
Fuck off. All right, stop teasing me, you tease. Show me the goods. Show me the goods. Show it to me. Okay. Uh-huh. Yeah. Yeah, shove it in there. Oh, that's hot. I want you to pour it. Mm, delicious. Oh, your yeah, resin is like so good. He's a pro. Love knobs. Good God, thank you. How do I get a time machine to go back 25 months? I'll let you know. Oh, it's hard. Wait, is there no bubble? Don't worry, bro. Where we're going, there are no bubbles. There is only thock and cock, of course. I am officially out of wine. By that I mean like all the wine. There's no wine left in my house. Fuck. How am I gonna survive? How am I gonna survive, boys? All right, come on, stop teasing me. Stop teasing me. Open it, open it. Oh, the snips. All right, take your time, take your time. Get some snipping action in there. How many times can he use this mold? I mean the Lego? Or like the mold he just made? Good question. Is anything gonna fucking happen? It's happening. It's happening. He's doing it, boys. He's doing it. He's gonna pull it out.
Imagine if he doesn't actually make the, the key cap. He just leaves us all with blue balls. All right, let's, let's make sure. Mm -hmm. Yeah, pull it out. The finished product is underwhelming. Yeah, I know, but it looks cool when he makes it. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, that makes me weirdly horny for some reason. Now the mold is made? Yeah. Why SA not cherry? Because then it's bigger. Yay, you made a mold. With no legend. Yes, yes, it's a mold, we got it. Oh, that's a, that's like the cutest little fucking measuring cup. This is just part one. Oh my God, you're right. Well, it's the only one in the list. So it's the only one we're watching. Eat my ass. I'm not watching part two. Is this how artisans are born? It's how some parts of artisans are born. Vote chat for part two? Nope.
That's right, boys. Gator dances are back. I got speakers. Watch this. Nope. Nope. Short stream. Everybody get fucked. You guys have many choices in keyboard streamers, and you made the wrong choice. <laughs> oh, you didn't fucking see it coming. We fucking got him. <laughs>